according to a recent Harvard Harris poll, the majority of Americans now believe, quote, Joe Biden was involved with his son uh, in what is an illegal influence peddling scheme. And yet, as far as we know, despite a mountain of evidence, now the FBI had Hunter's laptop since December of 2019. The FBI and the DOJ, they refused to investigate, quote, the big guy uh, who Hunter complained he had to give half his income to. And on the other hand, there is no shortage of witch hunts against Donald Trump, which we were talking about a little bit in the last segment. Now, the 45th president of the United States is back with us for reaction to all of that. This goes to the heart of Jim Jordan's investigation. Is the FBI politicized? Is the DOJ weaponized? James Comer's committee looking into whether or not the Biden family, uh, in fact, we, 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 we know that Joe lied when he said in a debate with you and, and said it to other press people, when he said, there, there's, I've never talked to my son about his foreign business dealings. We've got photographic evidence. We have dates and times of meetings. We now have, according to James Comer, routing uh, plans to different LLCs, and money's going to nine separate Biden family members. And they're looking for one particular document where $5 million was exchanged for an act that they claim that Joe Biden may have committed in exchange for this deal. Um, yet, how come nothing happens to them? Well, they're being protected, and it's a uh, one-sided system. It's a very unfair system, but they're being protected. Look at the time that Biden said about the billion dollars to get rid of the prosecutor. Now, if can you imagine if I said that? A billion dollars to get rid of the prosecutor? You talk about tape. That's on tape. That's so illegal, what he said. It's America's money. We're not going to give you a billion dollars unless you get rid of the prosecutor that was prosecuting his son and his son's company even though his son didn't know anything about energy or anything else, and he's on the board of an energy company, getting paid a fortune, by the way. No, the whole thing is crazy what's going on, and it's so bad because it makes them look so bad. You know, we talk about borders, we talk about elections, but you can add the... the uh, our justice system, if it's corrupt, if the people think, if there's any perception of being corrupt, and when you look at all of this criminality, like, the laptop has so much stuff on it. It's so bad. It's so evil. And yet they don't want to do anything. It even affected the impeachment, because impeachment hoax number one and two, if they read the laptop and they had the laptop, should not have proceeded, because I was right. And it should not have proceeded. A lot of people said that. But it is a dual uh, system of, of uh, government. There's a dual system of... You talk about law and order. You can't have law and order in a country where you have such corruption. And the corruption is... And they fight so hard not to give the papers. Yeah. With me, they make up papers. They fight so hard not to give a document. Now, how bad can this document be? And it's very dangerous. I think it's a third point, but it's very dangerous for our country. Well, Comer said to me on radio today, he has the document. He said it on TV last night. Hey, Sean Hannity here. Hey, click here to subscribe to Fox News' YouTube page and catch our hottest interviews and most compelling analysis. You will not get it anywhere else.